Elankulam Manakal Shankaran Ambudri Pad, born on 13 June 1909 in Peritamana, died on 19th March 1998 in Thiruvananthapuram. Elankulam Manakal Shankaran Ambudri Pad, popular known as EMS or EM. As Nambudri Pad was an Indian communist politician and theorist who served the first chief minister of Kerala in 1957 to 59 and then again in 1967 to 69 as a member of the Communist Party of India CPI. He became the first non Indian National Congress chief minister in the Indian Republic. 1964 led a faction of the CPI that broke away from the Communist Party of India, Marxist CPIM. He completed his graduation from St. Thomas College, Trishur. EMS Nambudri Part said, Why and how did our country fall from its brilliant antiquity to the degradation of pre British days? The answer is that defeat of the oppressed caste at the hands of the Brahminic overlordship or materialism by idealism constituted the beginning of the fall of India's civilization and culture, which in the end led to the loss of national independence. E.M. S. Nambudri Pat was one of the most powerful leader the world has ever seen. The capitalist America was shocked. After the Allies won the Second World War, America had an agenda to cut down the, the communist, the equality rights of the people in the world to support the capitalist growth. And to their shock, they found in a smallest state, in a corner of a country, corner most point of a country, in a in a democratic election, a democratic election, a communist government came to power that shook the whole world. A small, short man. You couldn't call him smart or ugly looking inside that small frame of the ugly looking. A flowing water of a brilliant idea shook the world and went to the corner of a place of India called Kerala to take over power. Such was the power of that small person. I am not very much sure where, whether uh, that that is also another kind of EMS brilliance. India always got carried away. The, the suppressed group or the oppressed group always got carried away by big talks and the communists to come to power was that EMS big talk as he was one of he came from one of the so called upper caste or above the upper caste they called them the Nambudris and he, he himself was talking about the Brahminic, their, his own caste suppressing the other community. Okay, forget about it. Just then let us look into this part. On one part, whether whether Kerala had got the communist idea against the capitalist or creating a equality right to give the oppressed caste a, a opportunity to come to the mainland. And the land reforms, what he has created, fantastic, which has created lands for the oppressed caste or the lower caste. And the education system, which is brought it, has penetrated, has given a, a deep kind, a kind of a powerful tonic or powerful injection for the whole country 
to realize suppression doesn't work so much better. But why, why people have selected, why people have went, they, people have not changed, the man created because he wants power. On the other side you can see Ramana Maharishi, again another small framed man. Do you think his physical uh, body looks beautiful? You can call it ugly? Both. Yemus Nambudir part, ugly looking or uh, the frame wise, I'm talking on the physical part. And Ramana Maharshi, who is called the most spiritual, a godlike picture created again from the Brahminic community, upper caste community. Basically, our Indian people get carried away by small frames so that they do not have to work hard. I don't know. Our intention, our insistence should be to prove that you can work harder than any other people. Do you think uh, Ramana Maharshi can work harder than the, the oppressed caste or the people who are working on the field? Do you think maybe, uh, I don't think when EMS can uh, do that, Neither he can open his shirt and show his muscle body where the oldest uh, tradition talks about that. I think somewhere we got carried away by again lectures and talks, not, but not on the practical reality. Hence again and again a leader comes and people are running. They are not wanting to stabilize themselves. They know if people have been taught that if they are strong, and there's no problem at all. You must say, why and how did our country fall from its brilliant antiquity to the degradation of pre-British days? Antiquity, brilliancy, degraded pre-British days. Before the pre-British days, the, uh, the Rajas was holding on, suppressing the poor. Brilliant antiquity, who was holding on to brilliant antiquity when the major part of the people have been suppressed just for a small minority kings. The answer is that the defeat of the oppressed caste at the hands of the Brahminic overlordship. Of course the Brahminic overlordship is talking about what about the kings? EMS has not thought about it, but EMS has uh, created a small pinch which may create a kind of a revolution in the Kerala state to, to give the communist a chance and when the communist was given a chance under the leadership of EMS Nambutari party created the land reforms, the education systems, even now. But what about the total masses? Total masses was looking for again a Brahminical ownership or again another king. So they all rushed up to the middle, middle, middle East. Again they wanted to be under the Arab domination, when one side British domination, before the, the king's domination, after the king's domination, EMS did not want, even though they were sitting there, they wanted to take out the power of the Brahminic ownership, should not again control that the country might uh, be defeated with the people living in poverty, but even though the poor people somewhat, use, we somewhat wanted a kind of a godly picture, whether they look good or not. That has not changed. The answer is that the defeat of the oppressed caste the hands the Brahminic overlordship of materialism of, by idealism that I already spoken about. Indus Valley civilization created the de destruction of our family structure. Even though the family is not the people, people are talking the social media and everything too much about their leader, about the uh, about the Congress, about the BJP, about the, this and that. They just wanted. A godlike picture, forgetting the godlike picture which they have to create in the family. When families destroyed that whole materialism by idealism, constant beginning of the fall of India civilization culture, which had led to the loss of national independence. Not a forget of national Your independence is lost. He understood national independence is lost because we kept on getting people from outside. But now my thinking is. Uh, uh, you have your stabilized, you have to love your family. When you know to love your family, then the joint family system is stabilized and the family tree is there. Then I think there is no problem at all. Problem is again continuing. We are living in a in a pathetic uh, poor state of getting carried away there. We are allowing uh, the, before it was the kings, 
then the British came, then the Brahminical, of course, the, the upper castes were, were ruling, and now what you are doing is, again you are running after BJP, you are running after Congress, you are running after this one, in a huge lot, what went wrong? Did the mass hypnotism by the uh, interest value civilization to make you a nobody uh, still created you as a fly to get attracted to the to the lights? All that uh, glitters is not that cool. That have to be examined. Examine that. Go back to the house. Love your family. Create a joint family system. Family tree stands tall and nobody can take away your dependence. You live a happy life. This is my foreign footage.